and welcome to the chroma side of YouTube so what are we doing I went to Walmart and I bought a premium sink strainer with brass underbody well guess what I don't care it was on sale um, in the clearance aisle and that's what it looks like and that is what I'll be pouring through now I wanted to get something with some holes here so that the paint would go into the middle and then uh, you know it would um, gosh saturate the middle of the painting as well as the flowers so I have some colors that I mixed up last week uh, I actually I accidentally mixed too many colors in my pores for my pores last week and so here I go again you know use what you have if you mix too much don't worry about it store it cover it and use it next week or the next time you feel like painting I am going to do a uh, dirty cup for this one but I'm not going to pour from a pie. I'm going to attempt my best to layer the colors so that they, um, they come out nicely, you know? So all I'm doing is making sure that my colors are the right consistency. This is the first time I've opened them since last week. Let's get us a cup and start pouring. Like I said, I'm very gently pouring into the cup because I want a nice layered effect in the cup. Whatever you pour in your cup last is what's going to be um, first out of the cup. These were all left over from my handbag pours. Uh, I did paint them last week. So I'm using up the paint that is already mixed. So now let's clear our area so we can get to pour it. Alrighty guys. Wow.
Now I have my white. So I'm just kind of moving the white out to the edges. So that I know the flow will be right. Okay. And I really like this um, because it's different and I know I'm always talking about doing something different doing something different but that's like totally the reason for art right you do stuff and you change your outlook on it and you play and you learn new things I absolutely love the colors that are coming up in this painting I love the blue I love the terracotta color I love the yellow floating around in different bits and places I love everything about this painting right now um, I love the petals that formed here and there's some here um, I love how they're stretched out here I love it when I get lacing like this because we stretched it it gave it's giving us beautiful lacing that's just about all I'm going to torch it and um, I'm gonna go through and try my hand at making sure that these corners are in fact covered I do like them to be covered I tried to keep all the corners white because I like the negative space very cool very earthy I still see some colors lifting and I'm okay with that I really love it I see some pink coming through here yellows coming up here orange a little bit of orange lacing there 
I'm really satisfied with this. Hmm. Very beautiful. So, let me get you down and give you guys a closer look. How cool is that? So, I'm going to start down here. This is the left-hand corner. And as you can see, all those colors are layered in and beautiful. I really like this. It's very beautiful to me. This is the upper left-hand corner. I'm going to try and get you over here so you guys can see the effect that color had in the white. Check that out. It's so beautiful. So now we're going to go down the center here. Look at the rainbow effect that we have going on. Going down into that orange and yellow and blue. And then we have this earth-like structure. Now let's go to the right hand corner. A little less white than I would have liked on that corner, but I love the orange and terracotta color right there. And then moving up, we have our mixture of all the colors. And, and then this effect here, let's see if I can adjust for the lighting. keeps adjusting to the light my iPad automatically adjusts there we go so you see that like lightning bolt effect of color into the white I absolutely love it and I love this smoky effect that we get on the white from that uh, terracotta and orange color this is where the pink is coming through that I was telling you all about Overall, I'm very happy with this painting. Okay, I'm going to get you guys back up there. So there you have it. Uh, me just playing around, finding different ways to pour and different things to pour on. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this and I hope that you guys try different things yourself because as always, it's always a ton of fun to try and do uh, just different things. Anyway, I hope that you guys have learned something. I hope you guys were inspired, and I hope you guys come back very soon. Please, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications whenever I do videos, and put them up. <laughs> um, if you ever want to get in touch with me, please feel free to email me at chromastormarts at gmail.com, or visit my website, www.chromastormarts1.com. And I hope you guys all have a really, really, really awesome, wonderful day. Bye-bye, <laughs> y'all.